Hello, in this video, I will show you how to test the proxy, how to select and use the proxy. Uh, the setup proxy is from this button. Click to open the window. The instruct following instruction 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Basically, the first is you select some, uh, put some proxy number here. Uh, you can get a proxy from public uh, uh, proxy website. For example, from this website, you can disable proxy, and uh, this is the website. For example, I want to find the fast proxy, and uh, you can just uh, simply select those and uh, paste to it. Our system will automatically pick up those the proxies address and ignore the wrong data. Okay then you say second step copy lines copy down and the third step is select and test you select all of those lines you want to test then click on test selected it will check each website one by one if the proxy is good it will say okay if it's sl very slow and if it's this they want uh, login data or something if this is a uh, wrong proxy, uh, bad proxy or very slow proxy, it will, it will mark the error. You can stop the testing anytime. And then after the testing is finished, you select the bad. Then click delete selected. And uh, here is, you can also select anything, then delete it. You need, a, those are the public proxy I just imported and I don't like it, so I just delete it delete select. I left this for. And uh, you can double click to check out this proxy and it will display your IP, the proxy's IP address. This is the Q Quebec, Canada. And uh, double click this one. This is uh, California, USA. And uh, this is how you set up the proxy. You can always disable the proxy. So this is no proxy. Okay, after you set up those proxy list, and only have OK proxy listed here, you can use it in automated web browser. Here you can check to use the proxy or uncheck to not use the proxy. And when use proxy, you can click here to switch proxy uh, easily. One click switch proxy. Those proxy are from the, the proxy list you have just uh, tested. And uh, for example, for this proxy, you can check your page uh, IP address Quebec Canada and uh, this proxy you check California Canada uh, USA and uh, this is a very easy way just one click you can change the proxy uh, in the system uh, the browser is using and uh, the change of proxies affect all the browsers um, that is used in system not only the current one it's affect the whole system that is one thing you need to know. Um, another thing is you can change proxy in the program. In your micro, there's a command to do that. It is uh, called proxy command. You can turn the proxy on, off, or use a new proxy. Let's see how um, on, then off, new, right? Off, new. So anytime you want to turn the proxy off, just run this command. You will see proxy off. And anytime you want to turn the proxy on, you can run this command. It will turn it on. And anytime you want a new proxy, run this command. This proxy will be changed. And so in your micro, anytime you want to change a proxy, just run this command. For example, if you want to create an account or do something, do some Google search, and the Google normally, if you search many, many times, Google will think you are a boot, and uh, it will give you an error page. You can uh, do account, say, for example, s uh, search 10 page on Google, then run this command to get a new proxy. Then Google don't know it, right? So it's very easy to just to use this command to change the proxy. 
Okay, that's all for this video. It is very easy to set up and use proxy. And uh, thank you very much for viewing, and have a good day.